Dozens of people in the Bay Area watched Harris's fiery speech from a watch party in San Francisco. Cron Force Sarah Stinson was there. I accept your nomination. Bay Area Democrats clapping and cheering as Vice President Kamala Harris accepts the presidential nomination on the fourth and final day of the DNC. The San Francisco Democratic Party hosted a watch party at Harrington's Bar and Grill Thursday night. We might disagree about our local issues and who we're going to elect for mayor or supervisor, but we all agree on one thing, and that's Kamala Harris should be our president. Many saying it's exciting to have a Bay Area native as a presidential nominee. Uh, Kamala Harris has completely re-energized the Democratic Party. State Senator Scott Weiner attended the watch party and says it's been exciting to see Harris's career grow from the city to the White House. I've known her for 22 years. Uh, when I was a junior lawyer, I joined the uh, San Francisco City Attorney's Office in 2002. Supervisors Matt Dorsey and Raphael Mandelman also attended. It's a great moment for San Francisco. A lot of us have known her for a long time. She fought hard for every role she ever ran for, for District Attorney of San Francisco, Attorney General of California, U.S. Senate, and now President, but she wins. Um, and what I think we saw tonight, this was presidential. In Harris's acceptance speech, she spoke about several key issues, so we asked Democratic voters what resonated with them most. The entire speech was so strong, it resonated with me. And people in San Francisco, we know who she is. This is who she's always been. I'm glad that she talked about the situation in Gaza. I think it was time to name it. So I, I do wish she took a stronger stance on it, but I appreciate that she acknowledged the plight of the Palestinian people. She's likely one of the most experienced candidates. Um, especially in this race against Donald Trump and um, yeah I just I, I love her I, I'm, I'm excited for for her to win this race a lot of people here say they wish they could be at the DNC in person but watching it with fellow Democrats in the city where VP Kamala Harris launched her career was the next best thing. Now, we spoke with Senator Scott Weiner, and he says, you know, tonight was historic, but now that the DNC is over, it's time to hit the ground running. He says they've got three months to make sure that the Harris Walls ticket wins. I'm Sarah Stinson reporting live in San Francisco. Back to you.